Live from Six News Studios. Ten minutes of nonstop news. Your hour by hour forecast. This is Six News Live at Five. A few days into five. Still ahead this month's food for thought. Our expert offers some suggestions for buying in bulk. Which items are worth the price? Also, and warehouse stores like Sam's and Costco can certainly help save you money. In today's food for thought, a shopping trip down the aisles. This is Channel 6 News Live at 5. Channel 6 News Live at 5 continues with today's Family Healthcast. With the tough economy, surveys show that 80% of us are cutting back on food spending and 45% of us are trying to eat out less often. One way to save for sure is to buy in bulk. In July's Food for Thought, Marilyn Wadham on the best basics. Healthy food can be found at home, and we can buy more for our money if we buy in bulk. One of the items that you might want to consider is rice. Rice in bulk might come in 5-pound, 10-pound, 50-pound bags, but don't let that intimidate you. It's a very economic, very nutritious food product. Break the product into smaller packaging when you get home. Put it into the freezer for safekeeping. And with rice, more than just a side item with steamed rice, also think of rice pudding, rice as a salad. Another great bulk item to purchase would be dried beans. It's an excellent meat substitute, so you're going to save cost on meat, you're going to save saturated fat. It's a non-fat food item, high in fiber, rich in nutrients. It's also only seven cents a serving. And consider beans in your soup, also make fresh bean salad with vegetables and also make it into your puree or a hummus and use it for a vegetable dip or a sandwich spread. And don't forget about beverages being sold in bulk. One of the most healthy drinks is tea. Tea is full of antioxidants, it is heart healthy, and it only costs three cents a serving. For meat items, do look for the frozen meat section in bulk. You're going to find individually frozen meat put into large packages. For instance, chicken breasts or chicken thighs you can easily take home, break those into smaller packaging. So the things to remember is make a grocery list, stick to it, remember to put on 